Hey, this is Leslie Samuel here from becomeablogger.com where we're changing the world one blog at a time. And in this video, I wanna show you how to create surveys in Get Response. Now, I made a, a decision at the beginning of this year that this year would be the year that I make decisions based on data. And the way I do this is by sending periodic surveys for my to my audience asking them very specific questions. And based on the data that I get back from them, I can then make decisions so that I can make sure that I'm giving them exactly what they want. So how do we do this? I'm going to come up here to surveys and click on create new survey. And then I'm going to give this a name. So I'm just going to call this a test survey. This is the name that I'm going to see. I'm going to give it a title. I'm just going to call it test survey because I'm running out of words right now. And I'm going to put for the description, this is my test survey for the get response video. Um, and then here you can tag contacts with a specific tag if they complete this survey so that you can, you know, refer to that later. Um, I'm not going to go ahead and do that. I can make it a double opt-in or a single opt-in. If I do a double opt-in, then they will have to um, confirm before you can send them any information or you can make it single opt-in. Um, for now, since it's just a simple survey and I'm sending this to my subscribers, um, for example, I'm just going to put it single opt-in. And for my thank you, I'm going to say thank you so much for completing my survey. I can give them a thank you URL. So for me, it would be um, www.interactive-biology.com slash thank you. And then I can give a logo URL. I'm not going to do that right now, but if you have a, a logo that you want on your survey, you can do that. It's a little bit of customization. Then I'm going to go to the next step. Now, this is what you would typically do with like a survey monkey. And the problem with survey monkey is you're restricted on the number of the number of people that can complete it without paying something like twenty dollars a month. But this is included with get response. For me, it's a beautiful thing. I use Poll Daddy. I pay like $200 a year. I'm canceling it. Um, so this is page number one, and I can then drag things from over here. So if I want to do a multiple choice question, I can put that here, and I can um, edit that question and say something like, isn't this survey feature awesome? And the options are only yes, and let's say yes, for sure. And option three is more than awesome. <laughs> you can choose to make it required. Um, you can choose to um, add a custom field. Uh, I'm not actually sure what that's about and it doesn't matter to me. Um, so I can make it so that they can choose one as a radio button that you click on or choose one from a list, a checkbox, um, choose many from a list or so checkboxes or choose many um, either as checkboxes, sorry, or from a list. I'm going to just put choose one. That's the typical thing with um, multiple choice. So I'm going to go ahead and save it. And then you can add more things. You can add text like, um, I'm going to just put for the question, um, use one word to describe the survey's awesomeness. <laughs> I must be bored. All right, I'm going to go ahead and save that. And then I'm just going to save and publish the survey. Once I've done that, I'm done. And here I have the URL for the survey. I can go ahead and open that. And I can see this is my test survey. And then, you know, you can go ahead and fill in those details. You can send it to your list and then they can complete this survey. And yeah, that's pretty much it. It's that simple. The great thing about this is now you have that data, but you can access that data right here with all of the information about your subscribers. So you don't have to log into SurveyMonkey. You don't have to log into Poll Daddy or anything of that sort. You can have it all right here so that you can use that data to make decisions. So that's pretty much it for this video. If you want to sign up for Get Response, you can use my affiliate link at becomeablogger.com slash get response. Um, so yeah, that's it for this video. This is Leslie Sama from becomeablogger.com, changing the world one blog at a time. And until next time, take care and God bless.